Jack's Beach has quite a few people out on the sand this weekend. Take a look now through our SkyCam network. You can see the socially distanced groups. You can expect more police, though, in the area as well. Ahead of the holiday, if people aren't careful, this weekend could lead to a surge in COVID-19 cases. News for Jack's reporter, Marilyn Parker, joins us live from Jack's Beach in Maryland. You talk with beach police about enforcement of COVID-19 rules. Yes, and if Jack's Beach police officers don't see people following those social distancing and COVID-19 restrictions, they will notify the Department of Health. But I want you to take a look right over my shoulder here. You can see these groups out on the sand. They are pretty much socially distanced for the most part. And if I have my photographer zoom in just a bit more, you can see that increased presence of Jacksonville Beach Police. They are out here and, you know, across the country, we saw an increase in cases after May major holidays, but a few people I spoke with out on the sand today say they don't think today will be a problem. How was it out on the beach today? It was fantastic. It was nice little sea breeze coming in, nice distancing by the people. It's a crowded yet distant day out at Jack's Beach. Extra police are on the sand during Labor Day weekend. Jack's Beach Police Sergeant Tanya Tater expects it to be busy in lieu of the COVID and everything that's been going on. Uh, we're preparing just in case the crowds are a little bit larger because people have been cooped up a lot lately. She wants to remind beachgoers the virus hasn't left us. One of the big things is, is reminding usually on holiday weekends, everybody wants to come out in groups and have a good time. Uh, COVID restrictions are still out there, so please practice social distancing when you're on the beach proper as far as your group um, from another group. Some groups were widely spread from others, and some people had on masks. Do you think you may see more COVID-19 cases in our area with a large... Mm -hmm. Not because of that, because of the distancing the people did, I think we're safe. Now, because of these large crowds, beach police say you can anticipate to see more police out on the sand this weekend than you normally would. And coming up tonight on News for Jackson 10, we'll look at the numbers of COVID-19 cases in our area after major holidays and how the police are going to be keeping an eye on the nightlife out at the beach as well. We're live at Jack's Beach, Maryland Parker, Channel 4, the local station.